The special counsel has asked for a speedy trial for this. Is, is this going to intersect with your case at all? How is everybody going to manage the calendar here? So in all likelihood, I believe that my case, as well as DA Bragg and the Georgia case, will unfortunately have to be adjourned pending the outcome of the federal case. So we have a little bit of reprieve and a whole lot of winning coming from the Donald Trump camp. As you just saw, New York Attorney General Letitia James said that the case against Trump will have to be adjourned pending the federal case, which I know you hear about these guys saying that they want a quick and speedy trial. They want to get they want to get Trump convicted before blah, 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 blah. It's like none of this stuff is going to happen before the election. You have to have both the prosecutor and the defending attorney agree when the case is going to happen. And Trump's people are never going to let this happen before the election. It's all bread and circuses. It's all there to distract and make Trump look like the bad guy. But this is the this is the crazy thing. So the, the elitists, the establishment, the Democrats, the Marxists, the socialists, these guys actually think this makes Trump look bad. This is booming Trump's support. His poll numbers are skyrocketing. He's got uh, minorities looking at him like, when the man is coming down on you, they don't seem to realize that people in general don't trust the system. They don't trust the establishment, but the establishment thinks this is how you shame the one guy who, who stands up against us. This is how you put him in his place. It's like, no, dummy, you're making him the underdog. You're making more people fall in love with Trump and, and trust that he is the guy to stand up against you because he's the only one out there who will stand up against you, who's got the power and the fortitude and the money to stand up against you. These people are starting to realize that it's us versus them. That doesn't mean the Democrats versus the Republicans or the left versus the right. It is the establishment, people who think you rule the world versus the people. And there's way more of us people than there are of you establishment folks. What Trump says is right. They're not after him. They're after us. They're after you. Donald Trump's just standing in the way. I mean, think about it. You have the Justice Department, the FBI, Twitter, Facebook, all social media, Hollywood, academia, government, everyone is against Trump. And you don't think the fact that he's smiling and said, joking about them wanting to put him away for 400 years, you don't think this makes him look better? You guys are idiots. Everyone knows all of those establishment powers are against one man. Everyone knows that's the man you should be standing behind. And I do stand behind him, and I hope you do too. This is the Unapologetic American, Mike Miller. Thank you for being here. Like, share, subscribe, smash that like button. Don't forget to click this video before it goes away. America!